my childhood, when I was growing up, I was living on the side of the road in a caravan and in tents. It was very hard because we were living with no tile, of no facilities whatsoever, no water, absolutely nothing. And uh, we got no education because we were never allowed to stay long enough in the one camp. We were moved from place to place, town to town, and county to county. So that's the way it was. It was very, very hard for travellers years ago in my childhood. Well, I'm a community health worker myself, and I work with travellers. I work in Clondalk Travelers Travellers Development Group, and we do a lot of site work. We go around the sites twice or three times a week, and we make sure that uh, everyone is okay and that if they have problems, they will tell us and we'll bring them back to the, to the centre with us and we give it to the, our gardener who will pass it on maybe to the accommodation worker or whatever, health nurses when we had them. Um, we also make sure that children's health, that their immunisations and all are up to date. We keep all of that on record now. And women's health, we make sure that women's health is getting looked after properly. We advise them and tell them about their appointments and uh, about what's out there for them. There's more sites now for travellers to go into if they want to, which some of them doesn't be their choice, they don't have their own choice. They just have to take what they're given. And uh, there's a lot of them living in houses as well, at their own choice. There's more education for travelling children today and there's a lot of travelling children going into college and passing exams and staying in secondary school and all, staying for a six year in school. These are, this is a big change for travellers. In the sites and in the houses they have all the living facilities that they really need. How have these changes happened? With the help and support of the Traveller Centre and travellers themselves. Um, travellers work with travellers and that and helping them out, encouraging them and working with, with Dublin City Council and South Dublin County Council and that. Uh, the work that I do it covers an awful lot and uh, it's better for travellers to work with travellers because travellers know what travellers need. That way we know where, where they're coming from because we've been there ourselves and put up with that kind of stuff as well.